Good morning from the French Alps. It's a chilly morning. We've had our first frosts this last few days. The leaves are falling and we had the Tour de France route announcement last week. So we've got lucky again. We've got stage 10 of the Mosin to Majev stage passing through our area. So that's two years running. We've had the Tour de France pretty much past our front door. And today I'm on the final 30 k's of that stage up to the Altiport in Majev. The race is going to come up from Clues on the main road. It's about a 1% grade all the way up from Clues. And then there's a dog leg turn at the roundabout just before Solange here. And then we're on to the back roads and up round the lanes past Lac des Ilettes. This is the Fizz Mountain in front of us. It's quite a key feature of our valley, apart from Mont Blanc of course. And we're going up the side of that mountain straight in front of us. This is the start of the final climb to the finish. It's 19 kilometers in total. Starts at 600 meters above sea level. Finish line, 1,382 meters. This next corner is where one of the Ineos riders, I think it was Kiyakovsky, fell off coming down in the Criterium de Dauphiné. This bridge carries the Tramway de Mont Blanc and they've got some new trains coming. So no doubt we'll have one strategically parked on the bridge when the Peloton comes up here next July. So looking at the race route, this bridge is specifically mentioned. So unfortunately, the race doesn't go through Saint-Gervais. After Saint-Gervais, we've got about three or four kilometers until we reach a flat section. Now this is about, what, 5%? And I'm in 36, 17. So no doubt Podjigar will be on his big ring coming up here. So we're out onto the flat section now, shortly before we climb up to Majev. This is Mont Blanc over to the right, Aguida Midi straight in the centre. Then we've got Agui Vert and the Drew, the Chain de Fizz, and this is the Ar Valley. So today I started my ride right at the end of these white buildings here, winded my way round this side of the valley, and then to the bottom of the climb, which is in the dip down here. We should have realised a couple of weeks ago that the tour was coming, because suddenly this road's been resurfaced. So we're through Majev and I'm on the final eight kilometers to the finish line. The gradient's steeper now and if I was Podjigar, I'd be attacking here. If you're a Tour de France aficionado, this road was the descent into Majev on the 2016 time trial from Solange to Majev. If you skied in Majev, this is the Mont d'Albois lift and Coat 2000 straight in front of us. No doubt one lucky team's gonna get to stay at the Four Seasons Hotel, which is just up here. 50 euros for burger and chips. This is the same finish as the 2020 Criterium de Dauphiné stage when Seb Kuss won that day. There's already snow on this cliff in front of me here. It's north facing. So with two kilometers to go, We've got this section that really flattens out. It's only about one or two percent. And at this point, they'll swing right and up to the finish onto the runway. Bit out of breath coming up that last hill, but then it is October. So this is the finish line. We've even got some right in here from when we had the Criterium Dauphiné. Finish line will be at the top of the runway here, which has got quite a kick on it just at the end. And I'm just going to ride up the side of the runway to finish off this climb for myself. So that's the stage 10 finish of next year's Tour de France, Morzine to Mijev. It's going to be a great stage, even though 
I think it could have been greater. When I first saw the route from Mosin to Majeb, I must confess I was a little bit disappointed. I thought it was pretty unimaginative considering we're surrounded by alpine giants of the Tour de France. That got me to thinking, if I was designing the course, what would I have done? So here goes. Mosin, I'd have taken the riders up the Juvert, back down to Mosin, over the backside of the Juplan to San Juan. Down the valley, over Chatillon, up the Rom, up the Columbia, over the Aravi, round to Majev up to the Altifort.